All right, so first we will be chronographing the uh, Blazer 10 millimeter auto, 200 grain, total metal jacket, and then followed by uh, the PMC 10 millimeter auto, 200 grain, full metal jacket. Um, be firing five rounds of Blazer and five rounds of PMC. PMC! Okay, next we got Bitterroot Valley ammunition. Uh, 180 grain. Uh, this one's full metal jacket. That'll be the first five. And then the uh, next five will be the uh, also Bitterroot Valley. Um, this is a 180 grain jacketed hollow point. Uh, that'll be the second five rounds. Okay, next we'll be firing uh, five rounds of a uh, Remington uh, UMC 180 grain. Uh, this is the L10 MM6. Uh, then the next five rounds will be a uh, Remington 180 grain. Jacketed hollow points R ten MM four. Okay, for our last uh, volley of rounds through the chronograph, uh, first we're going to have uh, 180 grain full metal jacket. These are made by uh, Wisconsin Cartridge Corporation. That'll be the first five. And the last five today is going to be the uh, Winchester 175 grain uh, silver tips. Uh, so let's see how these do.
Okay, so this is what we ended up with today. Uh, I've got the uh, eight different uh, 10 millimeter rounds uh, that were tested today. And uh, I have the average velocity in feet per second for the five rounds for each one. And um, on the right hand side, I got the uh, factory claimed feet per second. And um, looks like the only one that holds up is the uh, the PMC 200 grain full metal jacket. Um, everyone else fell uh, short of factory claimed uh, feet per second. Um, these are the only rounds I have to test uh, at the moment, but as I come across uh, more rounds, I'll be adding to this list and uh, and uh, I'll hope this list grows and. Uh, Thank you for watching.